All right, what is up, you guys? And finally, I'm bringing you this video here because they just released Creative 2.0 with the Unreal Engine 5 for Fortnite. And man, what we saw at that launch, the possibilities are endless for this game. It's going to bring a whole brand new dynamic to Fortnite, the different game modes, the different maps. And yeah. So in this video here, we're going to jump into the three that are recommended by Epic, which is called the Forest Guardian, the Space Inside, and the Deserted Domination map, which is like that Call of Duty uh, Rust map that if you're a Call of Duty fan, you know, you know what I'm talking about. So let's jump into the gameplay. Let's check out what this new Creative 2.0 can bring to Fortnite. Let's do it. Come on. Check it out, guys. I've cranked up my settings and quality to experience uh, these maps, uh, I guess, in full resolution as much as I can. And I want to try this one called The Space Inside. So we're going to jump in and check out what this map is all about. All right, we're jumping right into it. Creative 2.0. Got the graphics cranked up. Got this little cutscene right here. Here's we're in some sort of bunker. Exactly where am I? I need to get out of here. Yo, check out the like the graphics. All right, let's go over here. I take the flashlight. Looks like we might need it. The door is locked. Should be something here to open it. Key. That might be it. Keys tend to open doors. All right. Look at this. Look at the, the reflections of the light. It's like almost like a Resident Evil game. And it's funny, I'm using Tomb Raider. Lara Croft, actually. All right. We need the room. Oh. It looks like we're in first person mode. Check this out. Music is a little like creepy. What are we looking for here? What's that? The magazines. Oh, there's another lever. In case of emergency. Break glass. Okay, it's not working. Is there another lever? Am I missing something here? Oh, open door. That was easy. Oh, a pistol. Now what? Now maybe we can break that. Ha, I told you. Take out your gun just in case. Whoa. Some light reading perhaps. Okay, let's go read a book. Yes. It's like the Riddler in Batman. What's in there? Oh no, it's a trap. Oh, another lever. Uh, I'm out. Great, drop my flashlight. Can I pick it up? No. All right, we're back here. See another lever. Apparently there's levers everywhere, guys. If you're playing this map. Yeah, we ain't going nowhere else. Turn that on. We're going downtown. Whoa, where are we in Star Wars now? Look at this. Once again, I can't believe this is Fortnite now. 
It's like a completely new game. Maintenance? Fix it. Okay. Yes. Hmm. So... I guess we gotta find one. Where you go? Alright. Oh, there you go. Take it. Let's go fix. Nice. These cutscenes are pretty cool. Is it going to open? Alright, where are we? Cat Cave Diner. I like the music, it's like a movie. Here? No. All right, let's go back. Once again, guys, you got to pre like this is all designed and made by like different teams and creators. This is it's truly something else, man. Check this out. Okay, can you go? Is that a bullseye? Yes. Get the reflection of the lights and stuff. Whoa. We've officially left Star Wars and we're in Tron now. Where is this taking me? Don't go to the light. No. like Doctor Strange world. This is trippy. This is like the Matrix. This is where you meet Morpheus. This is pretty cool. Look at that. Can I shoot it? Doesn't do anything. All right. Let's go to space. All right. Now it's eerily quiet. All right, guys, we're out. Uh oh, we broke the universe. is death all right i guess that was it return to lobby all right guys so that was the space inside um there was no fighting involved or anything but i guess it's just giving you a glimpse of uh the type of maps the type of gameplay so that's what i'm saying we're created 2.0 now you can pretty much create any type of game. It could be an RPG game. It could be a shooting game. It could be a racing game. Who knows? But right there, you kind of got to witness different elements. Uh, we went from being in some sort of cavern or cabin into some living room. And then uh, we ended up in like some Star Wars uh, spaceship. 
And then into the middle of the universe, some Doctor Strange looking thing. Oh, and the Tron uh, area. And if you notice, there's a lot of cutscenes as well. So that's the space inside. I guess that gives you a little glimpse of what uh, Grave 2.0 can offer. Like, I guess from variety, from a variety standpoint. Um, let's go check out. Let's see. Let's go check out Forest Guardian. Let's see what that is all about. Here we go. Look at this. You got to take a second and appreciate the map. Look at this. The design. All right, let's go up. Uh-oh. There are wolves here. All I got is a pickaxe. Look at that. You can see the, the sun rays through the trees. Check this out. Uh oh. Whoa. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. What they're doing right now, it's. Oh, you got the boars down there. Look at the little fireflies, I guess, or whatever pixie dust that is. Look at this. Come on, man. I cannot appreciate this. Let's go down there. An attack? No. Whoa. Guys, just look at this for one second. You have to appreciate this. Oh. Stop it. I had to. It's over here. All right. Look at the reflection of the light and everything. Sorry, guys. I'm taking a second to... Uh, uh, That's dope. You walk away. So that's like inter. Once again, it shows you some interactive objects. Look at that. Nice. All right, let's go up. I'm telling you, it doesn't even feel like playing Fortnite anymore. Very good mantle. Another one. Look. Oh. Did I startle you? You got the waterfall. Maybe if I got a 4090, it looks even better. All right, where are we going? Uh oh, we got some wolves over there. Right, take care of those guys real quick. I can hit a frog. Hell oh, yeah. Another one. A lot of frogs down there. I'm scared to go down. Maybe go this way. This guy moves. What's over there? Is that where we gotta go? Right, I'm listening to you. Where am I going? Target practice. Where are you going? Come here, froggy. Stay still. 
Come right through there. Something tells you I'm gonna need some of that shield because that dragon does not look friendly. Uh, where were they? I guess I lost. Let's go back up. Check this out, man. I guess I picked the right operator for this Lara Croft Tomb Raider. What's this? I don't know, I guess. Go that way. So we're gonna go that way. Uh oh. I knew that dragon was coming. Look at this. Oh. That is uh, a lot of wolves. telling you man this unreal engine as the name states unreal return back to lobby wow all right and last but not least let's jump into deserted domination let's check this out once again i got my graphics set up pretty much all on epic or uh, as high as i guess they can go so hopefully you know game don't crash all right guys so it looks like i managed to load into a game um i'm not gonna lie during this recording i had to reset it three times just to get into a game uh it's a little glitchy as you can see choose your loadout take that loadout and let's go in It does look uh, a little grainy, but the graphics are up, so that could be a, a thing. Alright, got 
Get off me! Draw. Get out of here. How's that a draw? All right, guys. So that does it for uh, domination for now, just because it's a little glitchy and I'm not trying to restart this game five more times. All right, so there you have it, guys. We tried out all of the three new maps, at least that Epic has recommended. I know there's so many more that they're currently adding. But we did the Forest Guardian, we did the Space Inside, and we ended it with Deserted Domination. Um, Forest Guardian and the Space Inside, we jumped right in, no issues. Uh, Deserted Domination. I know there's a known uh, glitch where you get stuck on the loading screen. It happened to me like about three times. So that one or two rounds or whatever that you saw in this recording, um, it was like my final attempt where I was like, let me just try it so I could get the footage for you guys. So as you can see, it's very, very much like Call of Duty and that Rust map, but it's giving you three, these three different maps are giving you kind of like a view of where they're heading and the capabilities of what the Unreal Engine can do and the different types of game modes that you can add to Fortnite, which is going to just make it a whole brand new game pretty much. And you're going to have the original maps just like in the Battle Royale, where pretty much, you know, you jump on in a hundred person map. Um, and all the other uh, creative maps that you kind of uh, played around with. But this is going to bring a whole new level to the graphics, to the gameplay, to the animations, to the cutscenes. Uh, man, I'm excited. I'm ready to go. And I want to see all the new maps, including the OG maps that they plan to bring back. So hope you guys enjoy the content. Let me know, guys, what you think of Creative 2.0. Drop a like, leave a comment, and make sure to subscribe. I'll check you guys on the next one. Peace out.